Hi, Dr. Windish here again from Sparks Pediatric and Adolescent Medicine. Today we're going to talk about pressure equalization tubes in children's ears. Uh, remember that these discussions that we're having here are not intended to replace appointments with your children's pediatrician. If you have concerns, please contact your child's pediatrician. Our office can be contacted at 775-359-7111. So the question comes up often, what is an ear tube? Why do we put them in kids' ears and, and what's sort of the point of all of this? Ear tubes are little bitty tubes. They're literally only that big. They're placed in the drum of the ear. Their job is to allow pressure to equalize back and forth across the membrane of the ear. This accomplishes the same thing that really happens when your child's eardrum ruptures from a bad infection, but does it in a way that you don't get recurrent tearing and scarring of the eardrum. They're placed in there uh, and they usually fall out on their own in six to 18 months. When the tubes are in place, you should follow up with your ENT at least every six months to have them check the tubes, make sure they're open, make sure that they're working, and if need be to pull them out. Um, almost always the tubes heal up or the holes heal up when the tube is pulled out. Once in a very rare while they don't and if that happens other procedures can be done to patch those holes later. Other complications of the surgery include the risk of persistent drainage and if that happens we have to treat the underlying infection but that's easy enough to do when we treat that with antibiotics. Why do we place them? We place them because the recurrent infections and the pressure associated with those infections can damage the nerve inside the ear. And by getting rid of the pus, by allowing it to equalize and to drain, we protect that nerve and consequently can protect your child's hearing and the tubes go a long way to doing this. The question often comes up, what about bathing and what about swimming? Well, in the past we always had kids where uh, ear plugs when they swam if they had tubes in their ears. But more recent research suggests that even to the depth of the bottom of a swimming pool, most kids can swim without difficulty with tubes in place. You can't go scuba diving with tubes in place. But as far as splashing around and doing the kind of swimming most kids are doing, or even for that matter doing lap swimming for competitive swimmers, you don't really need uh, ear plugs. You can play in the bathtub till your heart's content, you're fine. If you have questions, if you have concerns, if you think your child needs tubes, please contact your pediatrician. Contact our office at 775-359-7111. We'll be happy to see you. Have a good day.